So what am I doing? I'm making what's called copper chops. What is that? That's when you can take old solid core wire and chop it up into little bits. And that's what they're called, copper chops. Usually large machines do this work and they usually cut them into like maybe one eighth long pieces. That's one eighth of an inch by the way, I should have said that. And I'm trying to make them under half inch really. Uh, now why and what good is this? Well, let's just say I'm making emergency money for when the big storm hits. And I don't know when it'll be, but you never know. And, and I'm talking about an economic storm. People that live in hurricane prone areas will buy shutters and things like that and put up, or put up plywood over the windows in preparation of a storm. Well, I'm making copper chops. And, of course, I'm still making my copper ingots right here. This is a one pounder or 18 ounces and this is a two pounder right here. This, it's came out to uh, 34 ounces. Also, I've got a couple of coins I bought on, on eBay. They're the uh, Ron Paul coins. They're made of 0.999 copper, one ounce each. Hello, my viewers. I want to talk about Spotlight again and their little flashlights. I keep this one in my pocket everywhere I go. Uh, it is really handy. Uh, it works great and when you need to recharge it you just plug it into a cigarette lighter. I've done a video on this in the past maybe you remember. Uh, well Spotlight sent me a few more flashlights to review and today I want to talk to you about this one in particular. It's great for emergencies, just like a storm coming. I mean, you know, I mean it make, comes in really handy for uh, those things that you just don't know when you're going to need it. Uh, when you need a light now or you need some uh, power to power your cell phone or anything like that and I know from experience you don't want to be stuck in a hurricane without power but well, this is a little bit of insurance right here is one that gets plugged into the wall right here in any receptacle for recharging it serves as a great night light while it's plugged in all the time and if you lose power then it will stay lit or it'll flash anyway like that and still sort of give you a, a little bit of light. Another thing it'll do is serve as a flashlight. Right now I'm in my garage which is generally pretty dark but I'm using this flashlight right here this rechargeable flashlight by spotlight to find my way around my garage another great feature of this rechargeable LED light or supercharger is that it has two USB ports right here where you can plug in say a cell phone or iPod or anything that you have that needs to be recharged. I've been stuck without power after a couple of hurricanes in the past and well if I had a cell phone at the time I sure know that uh, this little powerhouse would have come in handy. They have a website at 
12vspotlight.com. That is right. Right there. So head on over and check them out. Thank you.